No. No way. No, you're making this up. That's not what happened. You remember you left me there. You stranded me. You left me there in the hotel. We left the kids with your mom. Everything was great. We were going to have nights. That's not what happened. No, your mom called and made up some excuse about the kids not eating. She needed you. You ran right back and you just left me there. I can't keep doing this. That's a lie. You know, you look, I can't, I can't, I can't do this again. And, and now I'm yelling. My secretary's going to hear this. Look, what about tonight? Are we still on for tonight at least? We were going to finally see each other again tonight, right? The f what, what now? I'm dying from a lack of You know this, right? You can't. You can't. I've got blue balls in the office now. You gotta make some time for me and my needs. I, I can't keep doing this. My balls ache. I'm at work. It's been months. It's been months. <sighs> Susan, please. Please, you, you can't. I just can't. Are you there? Hello? Did you f hang up? Sorry to interrupt you, Mr. Napoli. I couldn't help to overhear you on the other side. Everything is okay? I don't know, Gustavo. I, I feel like my marriage is falling apart. I understand, Mr. Napoli, but how long has it been since, you know? Gustavo, you can't ask me questions like that at work. <laughs> don't worry, Mr. Napoli. All of this will stay between us. Oh, I don't know, maybe, maybe three months? Three months? Oh, I'm so embarrassed. Mr. Napoli, you shouldn't have to go through this. It's not fair to you. I don't know if you're gonna like what I have to propose to you, but you should let me help you. I don't understand. Well, let's say you don't need your wife to achieve your goal. 